Welcome back to Scottish Movies, and today I'm going to be heading out to a car boot. Um, I think it's going to be an indoor one because it's uh, started to rain, and uh, yeah, I'm going to be coming back here when we pick up, hopefully, uh, shortly. I'm not really planning on filming in there. We'll see how I feel when we get in. Uh, well, if not, either way, um, I'll be back here with a pick up shortly. See you in a bit. Okay, so we're out of the uh, car boot, and yeah, what a big fat disappointment that was. Um, yeah, there was probably about five, six stores at the most, but I did get a couple of pickups. Um, first thing I picked up was a Xbox One controller. Um, got this purely for trade. Uh, that's if CX take it. It was literally a couple of quid, um, so I thought I'd take a gamble. Uh, if uh, if they take that, uh, trade him. I think for 30 quid or something there or something like that but we'll see um, the only other pick, thing I picked up was a DVD of a film from I don't know I want to say it's, I think it's from the late 90s I'm not 100% it doesn't say on it but it's film starring Martin Clunes well it looks like it's been on a, a stag do it's called Staggered um, I'm sure I've seen this back in the day but, but it's a staggering romp from a British comedy in the vein of Four Weddings and Funeral uh, yeah, just looks like it might be a lot of fun, so I grabbed that and that was 50p. And yeah, that is all my pickups from the car boot, so yeah, rubbish guys, rubbish. But, day's not finished yet, uh, I'm going to be heading up to uh, Macadese now to get a bit of breakfast with my daughter. Um, and then I'm thinking I'm going to head to my local CX in the town of Altrincham, uh, might see if you maybe check out a couple of charity shops there. I'm definitely going to see CX, see if I can find anything. Uh, so, yeah, not make this uh, video a total washout. Uh, so, yeah, I will see you in McDonald's. So, the car boot might have been a bit disappointed. <laughs> got to McDonald's, got me breakfast wrap, and a nice cup of tea. Okay, so out of. Um, Mackie D's now um, with a full belly. Uh, yeah, the breakfast wrap. Um, I've not had one before. It, it was all right. I think I might go back to a uh, egg McMuffin and everything next time. I didn't think it was all that. Uh, my daughter had a usual egg McMuffin and everything. And was well happy with that one, yeah. 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 Um, so we're gonna head now to local town of Altrincham. Um, I'm just gonna have a uh, go in uh, the CAX. Um, there is. One thing I wanted to pick up in there, and I'll see if they take this controller. So, yeah, I'll see you in CX. Okay, so we're in CX now. Uh, just checking out the 4K sections. We've got some Evil Dead here, 15 quid. Uh, I'm not too fussed about upgrading that. There's all the Star Wars movies. I do own all them on uh, 4K already with slips. Uh, got a movie down here, 28 quid for a Criterion uh, blowout. Never seen that film. Uh, what else can we see? Uh, we've got an indicator uh, film here, we've got Christine, it's a really good Demon King movie. Uh, they are on a DVD of that, I think. We've uh, got some Dragon Ball Z, and what's this one? The Conjuring 7 film collection. What's, how much is that? Oh, I can't say. I think it was about 20 quid, which is pretty good. I've never seen any of them. Uh, we've got The Emperor's New Groove here, Disney title. I don't actually have that. Um, in the Blu-ray collection. Um, we need to grab that. Um, what else can we see? Some labyrinths down there. We've got some more Stephen King here. We've got Misery with Kathy Bates. Great film. Another Criterion here. I don't know what that is, but 15 quid. Street Fighter down there. I mean, it's double pack of tree romance and natural born killers for 12 quid, so that's pretty good. Okay, so I'm out of uh, Altrincham now, and uh, I have got a couple of pickups. Um, I've first up 
uh, I'm going to show me CX, what happened in CX uh, in a minute. But first up, I went in the Poundland, a local Poundland in um, in my town, uh, as a, like a, a section where you can get clothes. And I picked up a couple of t-shirts, um, I don't know if you're going to be able to see these on camera, but these are six quid each. Um, and the first one I picked up is this Miami Vice uh, t-shirt. Yeah, I thought it was, was alright. And I also picked up uh, this Marvel one, uh, basically Thor, we can see that, so yeah, so I grabbed them for six quid each, um, and then it went to CX, uh, unfortunately they didn't take the controller, uh, then one of the, one of the buttons was, wasn't right, uh, I'm going to try it again another CX. Yeah, like I say, it was a bit of a gamble for two quid, but you have two quid is worth a gamble because you get, uh, I think it's 30 quid credit back for them. Uh, like I say, I'm going to try it another CX. If ultimately they don't take it, uh, I've got myself an Xbox One controller. Uh, I don't even have an Xbox One, but I do have uh, a power pack for one and I've got a few games. So uh, if I just find myself the console and a couple of wires, I'll uh, have the lot. So that'd be a bonus. Um, while I was in there, I did pick up one ga game. Yeah, another PS4 game for four quid. Uh, and this is called uh, Dark Siders 3. I've never played a Dark Siders game, but uh, looks like it might be pretty good, like a hack and slash thing. But yeah, I've seen it for four quid, so I thought I'll um, grab that. And yeah, that is it for this little um, shopping trip and car boot. So yeah, the car boot was ultimately disappointing, but I'm happy we'll pick up some uh, CX and, and, and find my t shirts as well. So. Uh, all in all, it's quite a good Sunday, so yeah, comment down below um, if you know anything about Darksiders and uh, what experience do you have of taking controls into CX? I think it's definitely worth a gamble for a couple of quid. Um, but um, yeah, so comment down below. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe, and I'll see you soon for another video. Bye, guys.